LinkedIn believes B2B marketing can be B2 brilliant, B2 bold, and B2 breakthrough. How? With a platform purpose built to make B2B mean more for your business. A platform with tools to help you build better relationships with your key customers, to boost your buyer journey while building your brand. A platform with the trusted data and lead generation you need to beat KPIs, drive ROI, and stand out amongst the competition. And with the targeting tools on LinkedIn, you can reach your precise audience right down to their job title, company name, location, and more to make sure your ads are always being seen by those who matter. So get ready to be to boldly go where no marketers have gone before. Because LinkedIn is where B2B is everything it can be. Rethink your B2B marketing LinkedIn ads and get a $100 credit on your next campaign. Go to linkedin.com slash MPN to claim your credit. That's linkedin.com slash MPN. Terms and conditions apply. Let me guess. Unknown caller. You could reduce the number of unwanted calls and emails with online privacy protection. The latest innovation from Discover will help regularly remove your personal info, like your name and address, from 10 popular people search websites that could sell your data. And we'll do it for free. Activate in the Discover app. See terms and learn more at discover.com slash online privacy protection. On this episode of Winfluence. In the last 18 years, I've probably reviewed, demoed, or tried hundreds, if not thousands, of software platforms. The one underlying theme that constantly emerged in my brain from all that testing and trying was that one day I sure would love to get my hands on one. I would like to be a part of building a software solution. Well, I'm making a big move this week that finally puts me on the software side of the aisle. There's a difference between being an influencer and actually influencing. I'm Jason Falls, and in this podcast, we explore the people, companies, campaigns, and stories that illustrate that difference. Welcome to Winfluence, the Influence Marketing Podcast. Hello again, friends. Thanks for listening to Winfluence, the Influence Marketing Podcast. I've been doing this for more than 15 years now. No, not podcasting. That's about the last four or five years or so, and just two years so far on this particular show. But I've been doing this social media, digital marketing, influencer marketing, talking head thing for a long time. The first time anyone really took notice of what I was saying was when I started reviewing and talking about social media monitoring platforms. The industry vernacular knocked that term around a bit, and they became known as social listening software platforms eventually. In my book, Winfluence, I tell the story of how one such social listening platform made a seven-figure sale because I wrote about them on my blog. Still never got a referral fee, by the way. I'm kidding. NetBase, which is now NetBase Quid, hired me to do quite a bit of content with him in the early 20-teens, so all is good there. In the last 18 years, I've probably reviewed, demoed, or tried hundreds, if not thousands, of software platforms. The one underlying theme that constantly emerged in my brain from all that testing and trying was that one day I sure would love to get my hands on one. I would like to be a part of building a software solution. I'm guessing you've ascertained that from my occasional rant here about how the influencer marketing software companies aren't providing good indexing for owned content, or that none really take into account offline influence and other paths of identifying influential people for your brand beyond that which the social platform APIs provide. Well, I'm making a big move this week that finally puts me on the software side of the aisle. That's right. As of today, I am officially the Executive Vice President of Marketing for Scipio.ai. Those of you who follow my content might recall in July of this year, I published a written and video review of Scipio.ai. You can find that review and the video on my website at jasonfalls.com slash Scipio Review. I'll link to it in the show notes as well. In that video, I said this. Because Scipio.ai also enables you to tap into the influence of your community, your customers, your followers, and such, it's the first platform I am happy to call an influence marketing platform without the R. That alone should tell you why I jumped at the chance to merge my philosophy on influence marketing with a software platform and services company that thinks the same way. Today on the show, I want to tell you a little bit more about the move. 
what's in store for me and Scipio.ai in the near future, and explain what me being an employee of a software company that includes an influence marketing software application means and doesn't mean for this podcast. Spoiler alert, not much is going to change. I'll dig in more next. Influence. LinkedIn believes B2B marketing can be B2 brilliant, B2 bold, and B2 breakthrough. How? With a platform purpose built to make B2B mean more for your business. A platform with tools to help you build better relationships with your key customers, to boost your buyer journey while building your brand. A platform with the trusted data and lead generation you need to beat KPIs, drive ROI, and stand out amongst the competition. And with the targeting tools on LinkedIn, you can reach your precise audience right down to their job title, company name, location, and more to make sure your ads are always being seen by those who matter. So get ready to be to boldly go where no marketers have gone before. Because LinkedIn is where B2B is everything it can be. Rethink your B2B marketing LinkedIn ads and get a $100 credit on your next campaign. Go to linkedin.com slash MPN to claim your credit. That's linkedin.com slash MPN. Terms and conditions apply. So today marks my first day of work as the EVP of marketing for Scipio.ai. If you've been following me closely the last few weeks, that might be confusing. Many of you know I launched Falls and Partners, an influence marketing strategy consulting firm, a few weeks ago while I migrated work away from Cornette and to F&P. Cornette became a client rather than my employer, and I could open up my strategic consulting to anyone else. But a funny thing happened on the way to the forum. Sandeep Sangavi, the chairman and CEO at Scipio.ai, Grosin Edwards, the president and chief operating officer of the company, and Kelly McDonald, the chief product officer, and I all had some time together at an event. When I shared the news of my migration to consulting, the conversation shifted and their need for someone to lead the platform's marketing surfaced. I'll dig into some details in a moment, but I jumped at the opportunity to join the team at Scipio.ai. The clients of Falls and Partners can now become clients of Scipio.ai's strategic and managed services, and I can spend time with everyone I planned to, plus a platform of software and applications that I think are going to revolutionize the way we not only think about, but execute influence marketing without the R. What does that mean for this podcast? In a word, nothing. I will still bring you insights and interviews with the leading thinkers and doers in the space, from brands to agencies to creators, and yes, even my now fellow software and service providers. They may be competition, but they still know a lot about influencers and influencer marketing. The conversations we'll have together will be far more useful than anything either of us could offer separately. In fact, you'll be interested to know that I've got Isaiah's Ted Murphy lined up to tell you about his new Flex platform in a couple of weeks. Basically, this podcast will be presented by Scipio.ai, but it will not be an advertisement for it. You now know my role there and the respective biases that might come with it, but I think you know me well enough to know I will always offer up the best advice I can muster to help someone with their marketing, whether that directly benefits me or Scipio.ai or not. I will continue to invite and welcome competitors to the microphone to talk about their perspectives on the marketplace, and yes, they can talk about their platforms too. I promise you that I will continue to attempt to be a fair arbiter of the conversation and only inject the occasional recommendation or information about Scipio.ai where it's relevant. And the brief sponsor segment after our introductory information at the top of the show, the Space Tagger has occupied for some time. Speaking of which, it's appropriate to thank Tagger and Pete Kennedy for their support of Winfluence for the last two years. I still love Tagger as a software solution. I just now work for a competitor. Scipio does offer some different things, which I'll explain in a moment, but Tagger is certainly well worth a look-see if you're looking for a robust enterprise solution for your influence marketing management. And no, I was never lying to you. I did use Tagger every day, but I won't moving forward. Doesn't mean they aren't good or not worth looking at. If they fit your needs, you should sign up. Thank you, Tagger and the Tagger team for the support. And that brings me to Scipio.ai. What is it and what makes it so different and good that I would change direction and agree to work for a software company? Scipio.ai is a community commerce marketing platform. What does that mean? Well, that's actually one of my challenges in this new role, to translate that for you. So here's a first attempt. 
A community commerce marketing platform is a software solution built with a variety of apps that give you the power to uncover, engage, and activate members of your community. Find the most relevant voices among influencers, employees, customers, followers, and beyond, and turn them into raving advocates for your brand. The brands we've worked with to date have shown incredible results in increasing sales, strengthening customer retention, and growing customer engagement. Many of the apps have a core of generative AI behind them, and we're building more apps to make Scipio.ai the influence platform of the future. Think of it like this. You're making an influence cocktail. The base spirit you're putting in it is, let's say, one ounce of influencer marketing. Then you add a half ounce of employee engagement, a half ounce of customer loyalty, another half ounce of fan and follower user-generated content with a garnish of incentivization, and voila. The Scipio.ai Old Fashioned. I call it Old Fashioned because the platform's approach is very much rooted in the philosophy we talk about here a lot. Influence marketing. Focusing on influence, not just influencers. And that happens online and offline, inside and outside the company. With consumers, but also with employees and vendors and all those concentric circles out from the brand we talk about. What the platform doesn't currently offer in terms of features and functionality is on the roadmap, and I will now have a direct input channel to change or add. And you can bet I'm going to try and ensure the platform follows through on the promise to answer the call for commerce marketing through the influential people in your community. This is going to be quite the adventure. I'm going to learn a lot about software development, demand generation marketing, seed stage startups, raising investment dollars, and I'm going to bring learnings to you as well. But we will always focus on how those learnings can help you find better pathways to influence for your brand. If you'd like to join me on that journey now, you can go visit Scipio at jasonfalls.com slash Scipio. That's C-I-P-I-O. You can sign up for a demo of the larger platform. You can also register for the Community Influence Marketing application for free. Influence discovery and list building doesn't cost a thing with Scipio.ai. Accessing profiles of individual creators will cost you one Sendex token. You get 10 of those per month without a fee, too. You can buy more for a buck or so. And of course, I'll share more and keep you in the loop here from time to time. But again, I promise the only change to the show is really the presenting sponsor. That's Scipio.ai. We'll get back to our insights and interviews later this week, so why not make sure your friends and colleagues know about the show? Tell someone who might want to know more about influence marketing about this podcast, send them to winfluencepod.com or share a link to this episode on your social network of choice. If you have a moment, drop Winfluence a rating or review on your favorite podcast app. We are on all of them. You can also help make a future episode of Winfluence awesome. Ask your question about influence or influence marketing that you want my answer to or take on. Feel free to ask questions about Scipio.ai, of course. Send an email to jason at jasonfalls.com. If you're feeling adventurous, record a voice memo on your phone. Email me that file. I'll let you ask the question right here on the show using the recording. Windfluence is a production of Falls and Partners. The technical production is by MPN Studios. Windfluence airs along MPN, the marketing podcast network. Thanks for listening, folks. Let's talk again soon on Windfluence. Winfluence, the Influence Marketing Podcast, is an audio companion to my book, Winfluence, Reframing Influencer Marketing to Ignite Your Brand. Get your copy online at winfluencebook.com. While you're there, sign up for the latest ideas about influence marketing delivered in my periodic newsletter, or book me to speak to your company or organization about influence marketing. And if you need help with your influence marketing strategy, drop me a line at jason at jasonfalls.com. If you or someone you know is an influencer, a brand manager that uses influence marketing, or one of the many amazing people working in the influence marketing services world, and they would make a good guest for the show, email me at jason at jasonfalls.com. Our theme music is One More Look by the K-Club and Grammy award-winning producer Jaquire King. Thanks for listening, and remember, when it's not about the person, but about results, it's Winfluence. You may know you're listening to this show along the Marketing Podcast Network, but did you know there are other great shows on MPN to help your business? Lacey Boggs hosts and produces a great podcast called A Stone Marketing Detective 
little bit different than your normal podcast on MPN. Lacey, tell us what these fine folks will get when they listen. A Stone Marketing Detective is a fully scripted and produced fictional radio play that follows crack marketing detective A Stone as she bamboozles the bad guys and detects dastardly deeds in the marketing industry. The podcast is a funny, tongue-in-cheek look at content marketing, shady marketers, and suspicious marketing techniques online. And I think it's a fun new way to have a business podcast that improves that marketing can be playful and effective. 